Hello there, everyone. Welcome back. I'm Bogmond. It's 1929. Um, and the world's looking interesting. The world's looking interesting. Europe's not playing out how one expects. Wallonia? What the? All right. Right. Yeah, no. Well, the world is, is Europe is, is not as one exp you know Africa to be fair isn't what one would expect. Oh yeah, Madagascar's free. Can I? Can I meddle in Madagascar? Cause that'd be kind of fun. Ah, oh, nah. I don't wanna. I don't wanna compete with. Uh, The UK, or not the UK, the United States of it. Well, hello, Togo. Oh, yes, you're a colonial province now. Excellent! Which means you could be at factories. Oh, I'm having a good feeling about Togo. Alright. Back down, looking for... Places to support... Or, ooh, here we are. Yes. 0.95. It's, it's slowly getting up there. Slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. Just, I just gotta support them, I suppose, until until things work out in my favor. Mm -hmm. Oh, a fascists are taking over. Are fascists taking over across South America? Uh, we got a presidential dictatorship, proletariat dictatorship, proletarian dictatorship, <coughs> democracy. Uh, holdings of other countries. Oh yeah, of course, France. Fascist dictatorship, fascist dictatorship, presidential dictatorship, fascist dictatorship, democracy, alright. Wow. You still allow slaves, Brazil? I'm not sure how I feel about that. I'm thinking uh, we should have a long talk soon. There we are! Naval integration. We have more supply range. Yeah, modern naval design. Sure. You know what? Building you more, uh, more little roads, buddy. That's just how I feel about you. And more roads? For you, my good friend Egypt. Aha! The Ottoman Empire! Friendly with them. Friendly in Manchuria as well. Uh, what do we want? Acceptable safety regulations? Uh, it makes factories more expensive though. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Um. <sighs> Acceptable safety regulations. Well, that's it. Ah, oh, see? We just got a, a, some other, uh, some nice new ships. 30 cruisers, a 30 dreadnoughts. It is, it is a navy to, to destroy all other navies. To be sure. In fact, in fact, you know what? I want more dreadnoughts. Ten 
more dreadnoughts. Because you know what they say. Go big or go home. And my navy goes big. Oh, good, more cores. Fag <coughs> uh, promises in Morocco. 0.96. Oh, that would be nice. If Luzon flipped, oh, it would make me very happy. Build more factories there. Oh, it would be delicious. No projects, though. Algiers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, crisis. Oh, cheers. Cheers, oh, cheers, oh, cheers. Oh, eighth, you're about to hit back to being a power. You know what? I'm gonna back Algeria, I think. So I will not back you, France. I will back you, Algeria. But nobody cares! Alright. Uh, modern Naval Doctrine. <clears throat> Modernish Naval Doctrines. That's what you need. Man! Ottomans! You're terrible! I'm really disappointed in you. Really disappointed. Oh, you guys! Subtums. Twelve hour work day. Ah. Oh. Ah, fine. You only have to work twelve hours a day now. God. These people. <gasps> Who's on? Bam. Oh, that is that is juicy, because Luzon is a populous state. A lot of people in Luzon, and I'm I'm glad they've all joined us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Spain. Oh, hello. Spanish West Indies. Good. Game of Colonial Province. Good, good, good. Spanish South Angola. We'll also get a visit of cl of the bureaucrats. Uh, the new goose's patrimony. Okay. I, I'm not sure where that is, but but good for them. Oh, there, Spanish Hoseland. Now a state. Mm -hmm. Darfur. Alright. More bureaucrats to Darfur. I'm staying. Oh, the Niger Delta. Excellent. It's a decently populous region. So I'm quite pleased that they've decided to join join with us. Um, Bass Congo? Yeah. Here we are. Chad. What's Chad made of? Fi yep, yeah, Chad. You're getting bureaucrats. Everybody's getting bureaucrats. <clears throat> hmm. Of the 10th Olympic Games, who's hosting? France, I think? But I will, of course, attend. Of course I'm attending. <clears throat> Alright, how's that world looking? Oh, oh, okay. Interesting. Russia's still not part of it. Italy. Rising up to s number six. Alright. 
Alright, let's, um... Austria-Hungary, 908. Netherlands? Oh, close! Close! Netherlands is doing strong. Uh, Van Embassy... Italy! State of Egypt. Meddlesome resin frozen. Alright, yeah, there we go. There we are! Taza! Oh, Taza, you've been part of my nation a long time. Since the very earliest days when I went and I invaded you. Oh, those years ago. Alright, last technology. Let's see, Fez. Welcome aboard, Fez. Welcome aboard, Spanish South Angola. Ah. All right, let's let's keep churning out some more regions. <coughs> Bureaucrats. Bureaucrats. Well, I can build the ultimate naval bases now. How much are they? A quarter of a million. Yike. That's uh, a bit more expensive than I might like. Oh, more Borneos joined us. Good. All these states. Bureaucrats. Mm -hmm. Oh, Arissa broke up. Oh, Persia invaded India. That's just weird, but I approve. Good work, good work buddies. Anything that makes you a little bit stronger helps me out. There we are. Darfur. Now a proper Spanish state. Spanish Laos. And all these places getting factories built by my talented. Yep, yeah, expanding fuel factories. Building me stuff here. I mean, I, I assume they are. I guess it's not a very big region. But, you know. It doesn't hurt. <laughs> That's right, Italy. Oh, speaking of sticking it. Oh, Japan, right. You're a great power. Who is it that's not? Russia? Right. Can't influence them while I've got a truce with them. All right. All right, Russia. That's even your real name. Decision Firebird Doctrine. Navy attack up, Navy organization up through the amphibious warfare training. Good. But hello. Once again, another nation. Or another, another nation. Another colony. Becoming a state. Takes his time. What do we got here? Naval Firepower Doctrine. Good. More Navy attack. Invade versus the Spearhead. More attack and defense for all my guys. Excellent. 
Oh, we got lots of gold medals! Yay! Eight seven, eh? Mm -hmm. Oh, fast Congo. East Angola. Navy attrition down from naval exercises. All right, yeah, lots of war games. Oops. Oh, I was only there for a moment. Uh, Richard Kahn, and he can give me the uh, multiply the multiplier effect. There we are, oil different ships. We've researched all the things. And the concept of multiplier effects of spending an economy in the early 1930s. Hey, we're in the 1930s. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yemen. Yemen's got lots of wonderful Spaniards. Just needs a little encouragement. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? We actually got a lot of bureaucrats in Yemen. At least one percent of the population. That's almost there. Uh, hold on. First of all, we're going to create this colonial state in Dahuni. Then we're going to send them to uh, Upper Egypt. Yes. <clears throat> and now a crisis is underway. Um, Ottoman hmm. Empire, Serbia. What if I can get Greece? Maybe it's all decline. Ah, Germany's back in the Ottomans. I don't want to fight Germany. Nobody cared. It's a little sad, but eh, I guess it happens. <laughs> Yay! There we are. Yemen's flipped over to my side. Uh, Spanish. Oh. Ones. 1.8. No Spanish. No, 2.3. 2 2.0, 2.5. 2.3. Alright, let's let's go to Spanish South Cameroon. <clears throat> That's our next stop. Mm -hmm. Mm, industry's growing. As we knew it would. Uh, Alright, well, you know what? I'm going to take a break here. We'll see what happens next time. See if we can get some of those larger nations to become, or colonies to become states. See everybody later.